Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Breaking Nerd Reports. How's everybody doing today? I hope everybody's having a great day today. Um, June 11th, uh, Xbox Game Showcase is coming up pretty soon. I can't wait, guys. I can't. I'm, I'm happy to see this game coming up pretty soon. Guys, listen. We're going to watch the, the gameplay of this game called Star Field. And it looks pretty amazing. Let's dive in and then my opinions. Besides the game studio, Starfield, let's go. Oh, yeah. Okay, it looks pretty good. Uh, we're in space and stuff. Hey, the graphics looks pretty good, guys. I'll have to be, I'll have to be honest with y'all. These graphics... These like these got the dope. Oh my god, Starfield. Woo! I can't wait. I'm hyped. Oh, they have a beta. And we It's hard to express how excited all of us at Bethesda are to be here with you today. Okay, Howard. We're so grateful you're spending the time. Todd Howard, okay, buddy. Hey Todd, you better get good in this game, bro. I'm telling you. It's easily uh Destiny's kinda of falling apart. Like our previous games. We need a fresher view. You get to be who you want and go where you want. But this time, you'll be exploring space. So let's jump up. Alright. So, my thing right now, before we um, continue. First thing, sure, this Todd, you, you better nail this game, man. Because if you don't, there's a lot of people going to get mad at you, bro. A lot of people. I'm, I'm one of them. I can't wait to play this game. Um, I. You know what, man? I hope you nail it, dude. I watched it before when I started um, uh, recording this video. I, I watched it, and it's interesting. I'm not spoiling it. Um, good good things, and I heard good things about this game. But Todd, listen, man. You better not ruin this freaking game for us. game's been crap for years. I mean, this year it's been crap. Last year it's been crap. Destiny's getting boring. Nobody plays Des Destiny anymore. I mean... That's getting boring. Um, Call of Duty's getting boring. We need something new. Todd, you better nail this, bud. Uh, let's get into the video. Right in. This is early in the game as you arrive on the mysterious moon of Crete. Crete. That's the name planet. I'm the main planet of Crete. Looks beautiful. The graphics. I'm gonna be honest with the graphics. Look, the graphics looks real beautiful. May seven. Damn. This is a feature feature. I love this, man. Woo! Okay. Creep moon, uh, something. Oh, I love this. Uh, oh, there's a spaceship. Let's go. Let's get it. Yo, what the? Uh, I probably dig this game. Digging it so far. The spaceships. I love this kind of stuff. Kind of like, kind of like a, it, it, it's kind of like a, a kind of like a Destiny, but it's not like a Destiny. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Dude, I love it. Oh my god. Let's go. According to the scanners, the abandoned research facility is in this direction. Hell yeah. Hell yes. I'm gonna pass the word. I'm gonna kind of want to see some more. There we go. There we go. Everybody wants. Ooh, I, I kind of like the guns. I mean, I like the gun system. Okay, picking. Oh, nice. Look at that gun. Yeah, it might be a little Destiny ish. It has a Destiny vibe on it. I mean, it's not Destiny. It's not, it's a different company. But you didn't make this game. But it, it kind of has a little feeling of Destiny's kind of kind of gameplay-ish. And I like. Is it going to have PvD? I don't know. We don't know. Um, I hope so. This game looks freaking sick. 10 out of 10 right, oh, right now. Encounters, you're invited to join Constellation, who in the future the game is set in, are the last group of space explorers. To meet them, 
You'll head to the capital city of New Atlantis. We're going to see the capital city, like the main headquarters and loop and all that stuff. C- kind of like destiny, you know what I mean? You have the urge, you have the tower. Yeah, kind of like that. It's going to be online. Thank God. Thank you, Todd. It's going to be online, buddy. Thank you. That's a plus. Gothics are good. The gameplay looks good. The guns look good. I love the story. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. We're all here because we're committed to the biggest question. I like this. What's out there? Alright, so I'm not going to spoil it. It's not going to be a spoiler. I've seen it already, so I'm going to be, I'm gonna see what's going to come out. Um, a couple of spoilers. It's going to be a thousand planets. I hope that's true. I hope it's a thousand planets. Company of, uh, uh, I hope it's a thousand planets. I hope they promise a thousand planets for us. If they don't. Uh, I don't know. But. Say that it's not a thousand planets. I mean, the game's still good, probably. I mean, it is it any? I mean, people can complain anyways about something, but I'm not. I'm not I'm, that, that's not going to be like, oh yeah, it's not going to be a thousand planets. I'm not going to play that game. No, it's not going to be. It's, it's not going to be pushed away to play this game. I want to see the story. Seems good so far. The graphics, the gameplay, the everything seems good. Starfield seems good. Um, so, when's coming out? This year, 2023, uh, Xbox console, PC, and cloud. Yes, you can play with your friends. And I'm happy about that. I'm worried about that. Is, it gonna, is this going to be a console only? Is this going to be on Game Pass? Is this going to be Steam only? But right here, 2023, Xbox contr- um, console, PC, cloud, and Steam will have this game start through. Guys, make sure you hit the like button down below. Uh, breaking, uh, re- uh, breaking Nerd Report out. See you guys in the next video. Make sure you hit that comment button down below. Make sure you hit that sub button, that like button. Guys, make sure you hit the notifications out. Alright.